Hi, Mike Uhas here at Case IH. I want to have a discussion about how to input and implement into the Pro 700 monitor and what the advantages would be. So now if I go right to it here, we're going to hit the back button down below. I'm going to go to Toolbox. Okay, I'm going to look for Implement. There it is right there, the Implement tab. Go over to Implement. I want to make a new implement here today. We're going to have the 330 Turbo. So I'm going to plug it in as a 330 Turbo. 3330. Okay, I'm going to hit enter. Now what I have here is a, a couple extra things to, to note. We want to know the implement width. Okay, 31 foot, so I'm going to make it a 372 inches. All right, hit enter. Okay, I'm going to make my swath width the same. It's going to be about the same, so we'll make that the same as well. Hit enter. Okay. Now the final thing to make sure that this works on the area counter is the implement type. Right now it's set for a three-point hitch and we do not have a 330 turbo that is on the three-point hitch it's on the drawbar so we're going to use EHR1 to control it. So I'm going to go in and click that right there and it gives us two options. We want to choose the EHR1 okay and now with that all that information inputted into the system we go back to our run screen okay it shows our implement here is a 330 turbo and the other thing that really shows up that makes it nice is it shows your, your fuel per area or gallons per acre depending on, uh, depending on units. So now you'll actually know uh, how many gallons per acre you'll be using in the field. The other reason you would want to put it and implement into the system, okay, is when we go to the end of row, we can actually go in and if we have a, re a sequence recorded, we could actually go in and choose a sequence. So, and that's covered under another video under end of row. Close out of there, okay. So that's it. That's how you implement, input and implement into the Pro 700 monitor.